Hey guys, Sleep Silence YouTuber. Yeah, I'm back. Um, yeah, that was an interesting bus ride. Um, let's just say I was kind of in charge of everyone. 56 people. And, and no, that didn't really work out. Um, so, yeah. Um, so, yeah. So, as you know, um, I said in my last video, um, I went to summer camp up in Colorado. Um, if you're wondering, I was near that shooting that happened. It wasn't too far. And then today I got back and we had a shooting at a local shooting range down the street. Not too far. But anyway, um, so yeah, so I brought the binoculars on the bus. Um, to scope out any long distance buses so I will be able to record them down and to let y'all know. Um, so that's exactly what I did. What I, um, I kind of right up and I just looked out the window pretty much. Um, then whenever I got to camp, broke them all down. Um, and same for the ride back except for whenever I got home. So yeah, I got home about maybe four hours ago. Uh, just been really sitting and watching TV for the past couple hours, but whatever. I'm gonna talk to this one right now. So, um, so yeah, so we're gonna go over northern Texans, northern Texan, northern Texas specs um, and buses, uh, New Mexico specs and buses, and Colorado specs and buses. So we're gonna start with the northern Texas ones. Um, so yeah, Northern Texas ones are pretty much the same. Don't know if y'all heard that one. That was kind of loud. Um, yeah, Northern Texas. Uh, I'm not gonna go over those specs. They're pretty much the same. Um, Bluebird, Microbird, um, the Ford, like a 2006 model, I assume. Second generation ICCs. A Bluebird, a CB200 GMC. Um, and then I. On the ride back, um, which was last night, I saw a Carpenter Epi, Carpenter Cadet. Um, I saw a whole bunch of buses. It was like a little scrapyard full of them. I tried. I found it on Google Earth, but um, they won't let me focus or anything, and I can't see them. So it was just a whole bunch of box buses and um, stuff that I can't really make out. I think I saw a Collins in there um, from what I was making out earlier. So, yeah. All right, moving on to New Mexico. Um, now, we just really cut through New Mexico, uh, just a little corner, because we came through the Panhandle of Texas, cut through the corner of New Mexico to go to Colorado. So, yeah, most of it was just mountains and all of that stuff. Um, so, yeah. So, New Mexico, um, they kind of go cheap on their buses. They just basically spec them. Um, I just, what I really saw was yellow roofs, just, um, yellow, um, what are they called? Rub rails, uh, no fender lights, nothing like that. Um, on, sorry. Yeah, but you get the point. Uh, they just kind of cheaply spec their buses. Um, but what they had up there in one district was... A Bluebird 3800 and a uh, CV200 GMC. So that's what those. That's what they do. Um, I also saw a box Chevy bus, just a little Type A. Couldn't make out the type. Um, then the uh, the two rare ones that I saw, um, which I was not expecting to see, was a 1950s or 60s. Wayne Ford, conventional, um, that was just sitting in the back of that scrapyard that I saw, uh, or no, 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 um, it was sitting in another scrapyard, I'm sorry, I only got like six hours of sleep last night, um, yeah, but I think the rarest bus that I saw in New Mexico on all of the trip, um, I did go and look at pictures of the type of bus on School Bus Central, and I have to say it's a pretty close match. Um, I saw an Odina. Um, I, I, I'll, I'll, 
just looking up on school bus central is the only one that starts with an F. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, Joe, if you're watching this, then you're the one who's doing this. Alright, moving on to Colorado. Um, yeah, so Colorado, they have second generation visions. Um, um, they were first student run. Um, I saw lots of C2s. That also goes for Texas too. Uh, the Texas ones, they were all LEDs unlike the other buses. And they also had warning light visors. Um, so yeah. But the Colorado, they spec their buses like ours. I mean, they have the same basic things. They put strobe lights on their buses. No crossing gates. Um, they do have crossing arms on them. Um, but no school bus on the side because that's only in Texas. Um, <sighs> it's hard. It's hard. Um, but I saw a C2, a Chevy Wayne, um, like the one I got my control panel off of, um, a B700 and 3800 from a Thomas. Those were looked to be old school buses and they were church buses. Um, I saw. Um, two buses that were sitting, it looks like to be a high school or something, since it was only like a small old town. Um, I, I could make out one of them was a 3800, and I don't know if the other one was also a 3800 or a GMC. I don't really know. I assume it's a 3800, but never know. Um, closer to my camp, about 20 minutes away, um, it was a small town, and I saw these last three buses there. Uh, there was a TC, uh, FE. 2000, um, with the little pump, I should say, you know, I know how to describe it, um, but that was, uh, one of the buses that I saw, um, there was also, is it only an also? I don't think it's me, no, it's just me, alright, um, then these next two buses, they were, they seemed to be private owned, like some person owned them, made them all nice and stuff, um, but then they were an FS65 and a 3800 Thomas, um, they're all, they both had black tinted windows, air horns, um, what else do they have, crossing gates, you know, just LEDs and a whole bunch of other stuff, and it looked extremely nice, and I'm extremely tired even though it's, what, 1230, because yeah, I I was set back an hour or so. Uh, so yeah, you get the point. I'm kind of tired. I need to get some sleep. Um, yeah, I also uh, one of the classes I took was called cinematography, and that's movie making. One of the requirements was to make a movie. Um, so that'll be uploaded. Um, I'm not the one who edited it. Um, yeah, it'll be stupid. I'm not going to put it up right now, put it up in like a few days, um, it's really stupid, um, everyone said it was good though, um, I mean seriously, there were seven of us, of us in the class and we just thought it was kind of stupid, but you know, whatever, um, yeah, I'll upload that, I'm not going to say anything about it, and if you want to know anything about it, um, like I said, it's going to look a lot better since we used Adobe to edit it. Um, which I should probably get so I can start editing my videos here. Um, and yes, my lines are weird. Whatever. Uh, yeah, so make sure you subscribe right up here. It's much for button that says you're not subscribed to see if you to see Make sure you comment up here, down here, over here, over here. I don't know what to put down here with it. Make sure you also give this video a thumbs up or I will just stop you on the like, Never mind. Don't give it a thumbs down. Um, yeah, make sure you also share this video with a friend, add it to a playlist, add it to a, a feature, um, he has a future channel, I don't know, just do something. Um, so yeah, see ya.